previously on the lineage of Moonreach. So we ended up going back to my buddy's home and it was all on fire. So Herstag put out the fire and then I kind of disguised our whole group so we could kind of sneak in and pretend to be some soldiers. We pretended that Vocha was our prisoner. Tamara was giving him a few good hits. It was fun. And then um, we got some information kind of. The general guy we were talking to was kind of a jerk. But anyway, um, yeah, ended up getting information. And now we're standing outside of the tent about to bodega. The D20 Syndicate presents The Lineage of Moonreach. Welcome back to the D20 Syndicate Podcast. Yo! We are a Dungeons and Dragons 5e actual play podcast. I am your host and DM, Seth. And around the table, we have our players. I'm Billy, and I play Willem. I'm Tomas, I play Tomar. I'm Elijah, and I play Herstag. I'm Lindsay, and I play Pinwin. And I'm Michaela, and I play Gorbel. That's right. Each week, we play a session and we record it for your listening pleasure and we're now releasing exclusively on thursdays so this is uh thursday How, what's it feel like guys the so future bad. whoa feels, feels, feels like the like future <laughs> not thursday <laughs> exclusively not <laughs> that's oh, exclusivity you're listening for you to this live somehow <laughs> on itunes yeah telepathically whoa <laughs> uh but yeah anyway um everyone do a swear but boobs. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's two people who did a swear. Cunt. <laughs> Whoa. Like that's cunt cake. One. Like bunt cake. Uh-huh. Cunt with a D in it. Poop. <laughs> <laughs> Looking at me expectantly. Poop. <laughs> There's my swear. Did I do it? <laughs> uh, anybody else got some choice swears? Uh... It shouldn't be that hard. I'm moving on. What's the best one? I said boobs, <laughs> so <laughs> you're, the the bar is very low. Well, let me get one. Oh, is this mandatory? Yes, we like, can't start until you have go. a... No, this is how we go. <laughs> oh. get We're getting locked in. Say oh, a swear. My bad. Taffy. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude. He went, I thought cunt was bad, but... <laughs> Pickle! There we go. Pickle we're, weasel. <laughs> That's the best I can do. All right. <laughs> I know what Literally hurts. one of those was a curse word. <laughs> cake. <laughs> taffy. If you guess cake. Um, so we have a correct. review. Do we? On Facebook. Ooh. Oh, shit. You, go ahead and read that. All right. This is from Reese and McDuffie. That sounds familiar. Wow. <laughs> Very yeah. entertaining. She period. sounds old. <laughs> I felt myself looking forward to the night's end so I could pop in my earbuds and get lost in their world. I don't like no this already. No punctuation. That's it. <laughs> no That's a review. Thanks, five Reese. Five out of five. Thank you, Reese. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Reese. If thanks. you eventually get to this episode. Because <laughs> she just started, so probably not. She just discovered earbuds. Yeah. <laughs> what she had was a podcast? She had them in her mouth for a while, but she figured it out. <laughs> Um, if you want to leave a review, we will read it. Yeah, we will. No matter who you are, or who you happen to be related to. Yeah. Or how much you hate it. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, read. The, I mean, give us a, a scathing review and we'll read it. Yeah. But make sure it's We're funny. We're unafraid. Yeah. We, yeah, at least try it. Like, it just says, yeah. sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one star. Yeah, one out of five stars. <laughs> they, <laughs> they write that as the review. One out of five stars. <laughs> a bit um, shit in it. <laughs> It's not a very good podcast, is it? (laughs) (laughs) It's not very good, is it? Um, (laughs) So, uh, let's do an around the campfire question. You guys ready? If you want to leave a campfire question, sign up for our Patreon, and you can ask the party whatever you want. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do an around the campfire question. Okay, (laughs) in your journeys so far... Which of the many varied people populating this world have you enjoyed interacting with the most? And who's your least favorite? Gorble. Easy. Least favorite, Dildane. He sucks. He's annoying. (laughs) 
he I brings bad juju wherever he goes. <laughs> hate him. Favorite. Took me by surprise, but it's let. He kind of gets me. <laughs> like, I I really didn't like him at first, but yeah, he now I could, first. like, kind of see us, like, being roommates someday. Oh, I was like, yeah. that's not where I was Let's expecting get. him to go. Like, taking on the world together. And he's a dwarf now, too. That part sucks, but... <laughs> <laughs> dwarf racism. <laughs> um, if you grow up around him, you just hate him. <laughs> Willem, you've had the most limited amount of time, but... Uh, so, I'm still very partial to Zyko. Very uh, cool. Zyko has been with us forever at this point and he's just a good dude uh, my f- least favorite that we've interacted with so far go ahead and hurt my feelings I don't care probably Seth <laughs> 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 the DM uh, the god <laughs> uh, you've never interacted with him so <laughs> next um, we totally have it's Calcifer <laughs> <laughs> I literally just picture Seth dancing <laughs> 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 Maybe that's what why I'm kind doing? of attracted to Calcifer. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here first, folks. Um, I honestly, uh, I don't have any particular one that sticks out uh, to me as a least favorite at this point. Um, <laughs> Guess who's getting experience today? <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. That's Anyone? Fun. Villain? Uh, well, he's had the least amount of time. Yeah, but it's true. That that one guy in the bar in that place <laughs> that Tamar to, to headbutted. Oh yeah, one. way back in the day, the rich the guy, snooty guy, yeah, yeah the snooty, snooty guy. rich guy. I really hated that guy. I, I just still haven't landed a headbutt on the show. Yeah, every I, time I try, I miss. <laughs> <laughs> Throwback to yeah before the show, but I just imagine the concierge from uh, Ferris Bueller's Day Off. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's canon. Sweet. Um, Pinwin. Well, my favorite would probably have to be Durant just because he's one of my favorite people ever. But Lindsay's favorite is whenever you do let because I really like when you have to go ha ha before you get into the voice and then the voice is really funny. And then my least favorite would be, um, no, I'm probably, I don't know, pretty much everyone is my favorite they're all my friends. And it's very Pinwin. Yeah, I don't really have people that aren't my friend, except for Willem when he wasn't my friend, but now we're friends, so. Are and we? he's not an NPC. <laughs> yep. We are. Yet. <laughs> Tomar. Uh, favorite would probably be Rory, because um, I like jamming out with that guy and creating stuff. I'm kind of living vicariously through him now, because I used to be able to create create stuff myself out of thin air, but... I think I give him good ideas, and we bounce off each other really well. Um, uh, the one I hate the most would probably be Rytus, mm-hmm. because fuck that guy, <laughs> that nobody piece of shit. Um, yeah. Cool. That guy sucks. And I, and I do I do enjoy the fact that Rytus, uh, like, in the lore of the world, Rytus is well known as being, like, one of the best swordsmen um, on in the Veiledland army, but he and never he, even got a chance to do anything because you guys whooped his ass so he bad. Died, <laughs> died alone yeah. in a cell. Yeah. Maybe he shouldn't have been the best dick in the world as well. And then we want to keep the um, best I dick have not good authority that he is not the best. Dick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, her stag. Mm. I would have to say that my favorite was Verolas. He was oh, a real yeah. cool dude. <laughs> he looked really cool. Um, he was cooking that uh, stew stew or whatever. <laughs> that was really good. Um, I think actually, he made the I, tea. I'm not sure. You, if fa- it was you stew. found the stew earlier. But yeah, he made. Did tea. he have a cauldron of? Uh, he was cooking. It wasn't something. stew. Oh, he was. was yeah, that. he was cooking something, but you guys never like tasted that. So he offered us tea. Yeah, he made tea for you guys. Yeah, that was a really good tea. <laughs> um, <laughs> so good, I remembered it. <laughs> and it's a real shame that we had to abandon him in the starlight plane, but yeah, whatever. 
He was so cool about it, though. Que sera, sera. <laughs> yeah. Maybe we can go back and get him sometime. There we Who go. Knows? Um, then my least favorite is the Nightmare Diamond. Really don't like that guy. <laughs> <laughs> like, worship me. <laughs> if it named, like, Nightmare Diamond, you're bound to have a bunch of people that really love you. I don't you're gonna have a bunch know. of negative <laughs> Yelp reviews. I require worship. Like, if, oh. you, if you want worship, like, it's that, I feel like that's something you should have to earn. You know? <laughs> not, like, worship me. <laughs> so thanks for applying and coming in today for this interview. Uh, you put on here, your name is Nightmare Diamond. <laughs> Yes. That. <laughs> Worship. I have no experience. I'm hoping to get experience washing dishes. Mm, well. Under relevant skills, it just says, I, I don't know. <laughs> References. So it, say, it says I don't here, know. Yeah, it says here you require worship. What's all that about? I require worship. <laughs> I like the well, cut of your jib. Might, <laughs> you're hired, you're hired. You want to be like the boss or something? Yes. <laughs> it's cold stone. Me. <laughs> <laughs> I put so, a tip in, you have to sing. I no. love Nightmare Diamond. <laughs> yeah, everyone all of a sudden just, I love Nightmare Diamond. <laughs> he makes other people yeah, he's sing like, when they tip. Tip me. <laughs> he just starts purring. You will sing. <laughs> The song of my people. I think Nightmare Diamond is a cat. <laughs> You've a cat-like personality. Yeah. Diamond cat. Diamond tap. Um, all right. Like diamond pussy. <laughs> uh, do we have any other things? Yeah. Yep. Uh, uh, we have a couple up. of people that leveled up. Moving on up. Oh, yeah. Leveling up. Uh, Moving on up. Gorble, you leveled up. Tell us oh, what you yes, did. Yes, I did. Um, <laughs> so my initiative is one point better. It's now... Plus seven. Woo. Um, and I got a ninth level spell. Nice. Yee. I already told you guys what it was. It's exciting. I couldn't wait. Tell them. It's Mass oh, Polymorph. Ah. Ah. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and then Herstag, you also leveled up. I did. Uh, my proficiency bonus went up by one. Mm-hmm. So now I have like 11 in survival and Ooh. perception, which is cool. Ooh. And uh, I unlocked a ninth level spell. And I chose Foresight. Oh, nice. That was that was close to being the one that she chose. That's, that's <laughs> I chose Foreskin. <laughs> it's a protective coat. <laughs> Coating of skin. So Foresight is fucking sweet. It is. Um, and and I hopefully, can't use it right now because it takes a minute to cast. So hopefully you'll get a chance to use it. Yeah. Fingers crossed. As, Anybody else? Uh, yeah. I think that was no. it. Just you two. No. Um, all right. So, shall we get started? No. Nah. <laughs> well, that's it for today, folks. Um, <laughs> Bye. 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 Um, so, yeah, you guys are standing outside of the large tent of Burnus the Bloody. and Do we know his name? Yeah. I'm, I feel like he, I've never he's, heard he's, that before. He's the remaining uh, um, crowns guard, crowns guard crowns. other than Uthor the Undying, who has is now MIA after you guys kind of teamed up slightly. After you murdered him, and then he came back to life, and then you teamed up a little bit. Yeah, see? Lord Commander Burnus. Okay. Yeah. And uh, dog army. Often rumored, as I mentioned last time, often rumored to be the strongest and most capable member of the um, Crown's Guard. So not the best blade, but he's Not the strongest. best dick. Yeah, not the best dick. <laughs> Pipe for days. Um, <laughs> <laughs> he was charged with protecting the queen. So well, he fucked up. Yep. So yeah. <laughs> Just yelp. <laughs> but the world knows him as a very, very powerful ad- adversary or a very, very powerful boon for the Vildalin army. So uh, yeah. So that's where you guys are. You were screaming Bodega as we exited the last episode. And now... You're going to tell me what you're doing with your surprise round. Go ahead and roll initiative, and then I'll keep track of that. And then you guys tell me what your plan is. We'll go We'll go uh, clockwise here. So, Willem, you tell me yours first, and then we'll go Tomar, Herstag, and then Gorbel. So my initiative is 15. I said we'll go with <laughs> Willem first. 21. Oh. Okay. Go ahead. 11. All right. Me too. Sorry. Cool. 15. Okay. 24. Okay. Oh, should I roll for Smoochie, too? Uh, yes. Please roll for Smoochie. He gets That's not advantage. fair. He gets to play with multiple people. <laughs> Ooh. 
<laughs> oh yeah. yeah I need to... Just one second. That was a natural twenty. Oh nice. Um, Smoochie would get to go first. <laughs> Asshole. He probably has really, yeah, <laughs> decent well, initiative. He has, He's he gonna has chop a, that guy right in half. He has advantage on initiative. He's so gonna was, run up to him and chop Burnus in two. I got an eighteen and a twenty for that. Eighteen and a twenty? Yeah. No. For Smoochie. What is your actual initiative? It's uh, twenty-three total. Twenty-three total. <laughs> <clears throat> Confusing the man. So he isn't actually going first. So who had higher than that? Me. Pinwin. Oh, nice. All right. No, Fuck. no, because Michaela and I have the same role. Yeah, but she has a higher initiative. Okay, so that's how we're doing. Yeah, it. I've, I've just figured that's easier. That's good. Mm, that that's what sense. I was going to suggest. All right, so, Pinwin, you're first up. You all yelled Bodega, and you're first to act. What are you doing? So, I'm going to cast this spell for the first time. I'm going to... Oh, and st- sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you, but I do want to specify... I imagine this will all be happening within about a second of each other since you guys are all attacking at once. So you're going to tell me what you're going to do, and then we're going to roll it out. So did we all yell out, Bodega? I think it was in in your heads, but yeah, you all yelled it at the same time. Okay. Correct. So I'm going to take my pick out quick and give it a strum for a starting chord, and then I'll do like Disney princess style. Ah! And then <laughs> animate objects. Okay, so with animate objects, Penguin, what are you targeting? I'm going to target the large pole in the middle that holds up the tent. Okay. The table that's inside the tent, because that was medium and might do some help. Okay. Um, two of the swords that we brought in with us that we stole from that one sad soldier situation. Um, and then just two small of the tent spikes, because why not? Okay. So you're going to cast that. So next, uh, Smoochie. So Smoochie would be doing what? Um... Or I can... I'm going to charge in okay. and start chopping okay. at the enemies. Willem, what are you going to be doing? I am going to cast Blindness as soon as we get into the tent. So I'm readying myself. Okay. And you're, okay, you're I'm readying gonna, it. Gotcha. I'm going to bring up the rear, and once I have line of sight on Burnus, mm-hmm. I'm going to cast Blindness on that motherfucker. Okay, perfect. Her stag. Um, so how far away are the enemies, by the way? Uh, they're, like, around. It's, it's a huge camp full of enemies. So the enemies are off the map that way? Yeah, they'd he's, be... He's unguarded completely? He had the two guards there that he sent away. And then you guys have... This tent is kind of off to itself. Then basically where Billy's pocket is would be kind of where that um, the tree line goes. And it, the tree line goes around here. It's pretty much heavily forested all around because it is a clearing in the forest. So, But most of everyone is going to be over in this area. Oh. That's where all their tents and stuff are. Okay, so Smoochie raged and then he ran to that group, the closest group. Oh, he's not running into the tent? No. Okay, gotcha. He's going to run. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, I should have clarified that. Yeah, to the enemies that way. Okay. All right, now what's her stag doing? <clears throat> all right. Her stag... Are they within 300 feet? The The, enemies? Yes. He is going to cast Whirlwind. Okay. And as he's doing this, I'm going to start calling out as loud as I can. This is a sacred land, and you are trespassing here. You are not welcome, and you will pay for for the sins you've committed here. Okay. Then I'm going to start blasting them. Gorble, what are you going to do? Um, is it just the one guy in the tent? Uh, you can't see inside the tent, so as far as you know. I mean, I was just in there. You were, a f- yeah, a few moments ago. I will cast Fairy Fire in that 20-foot cube within the tent. Okay, so you're going in, you're just going to cast it inside the tent? Mm-hmm. Gotcha, perfect. And Tomar, what are you going to be doing? Uh, I'm going to slam Steel Song into the ground, and I'm going to cast Terminal Velocity. Okay. So everyone's speed is enhanced by 15 feet for 10 rounds. Okay. Uh, In addition, when I cast this, we all receive one free action at the start of our next turn. Wow, that's a good way to use a surprise attack. 
So after that, with my other free action, I'm going to run towards the tent, not knowing that Pinwin is about to animate all that shit in there. Yeah. Um, and Zyko, um, so, well, I'll describe it. Uh, they're, they're all in the same initiative here, just in order. So, um, okay, so let's do that. So the first thing that happens is Pinwin, shing, casts animate objects, and you, Tomar, are running in. Gorbel, um, you cast Fairy Fire inside. Willem, you're readying your um, your spell, Blindness. Herstag aims. He sees Smoochie kind of turn and head off this way. He aims his Whirlwind over at these soldiers. You guys see Zyko watch Smoochie run off, and he, too, goes to chase Smoochie to go off because he's obviously going to follow him into battle. Um, and you guys actually watch as the Chaos Company. Vocha runs with Smoochie. Uh, Mori goes with Smoochie and Lance goes with Smoochie, but Herc stays near you guys and starts running in towards the tent. All right, so the Tomar, you're the first through the tent. You push the flap open and you just see, you can see that the beam in the center has dropped down and it's it's like flipping around like a helicopter. So I actually wanted to pull all of it out because the tent itself would be really heavy. Mm-hmm. So then I was hoping that hopefully come on top of him and he'd be struggling and then I'd take all my objects and like okay. fucking attack. So the him. first order of business would be to pull everything out then in that first round? Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. And have that thing fall on him. But yeah, so you're going to pull everything out. Um, so for flavor, instead of a spinning helicopter blade, you narrowly dodge as the pull goes to the side because you're running in top speed and everything flies out. You guys watch as all these objects just fly out of the tent and then it just collapses and you can see the shape of Tomar being encased in this tent. Um, Smoochie. Do, do I still have my oh, sorry. my free action? Because all I did was run in. Okay, like yeah. I didn't do anything. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so you're gonna see Tomar's shape and then you're gonna see it suddenly fall down like <laughs> <laughs> like Luke Skywalker in Last Jedi. Okay. Shoo, and then he's gonna appear above the tent. Okay. And he's gonna swing down with his sword uh, onto um, Burnus's lump shape. <laughs> yeah. Lumpy Burnus. So he's okay. doing death Which from is above. Glowing. Okay. What's that? Which is glowing. Yeah. So he has advantage. That's yes. So good. Sick. Okay. I'm trying to figure out if you were affected by the fairy fire. You would be affected by it if because it's in a twenty foot. In yeah. First. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Um. Thirteen. Thirteen. Sorry, you're affected by yeah. it. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> you are affected by fairy fire. Burnus needs to make a a deck saving throw. Mm-hmm. He are, he is affected by the fairy fire. Oh, another one. Gotcha. Yes. Um, you have disadvantage if you're in a chair and covered in a tent. <laughs> uh, yeah, I would think so. <laughs> um, so yeah, he's what? It, yeah, he didn't roll very high. I rolled like nine. Okay. Can he breathe in there? <laughs> <laughs> but find out. <laughs> okay, so um, twenty-seven to hit. Okay, that hits. Uh, eighteen damage, and then ugh, one force damage. <laughs> okay, and he's knocked back ten feet. Okay, so it'll be a little restraint underneath there, but he will say he gets knocked back like about five feet because he's wrapped up in the fucking and he's in a chair <laughs> so, just, so you guys watch Tomar like the lump disappears and he reappears up above like yeah, slashes cuts a hole in the fabric hits Burnus and he's still underneath the fabric but there's a big hole now and the lump has moved Anyone have men? and he's lit up <laughs> and her stag is casting your whirlwind. Whirlwind. And, of course, these soldiers are... Yeah. I'll cast it as 300 feet out into a big... Oh, okay. Wow. So, yeah, you got, if you, if any were looking, you'd see this tornado of, <laughs> of soldiers starting as to appear. As I was yelling and pissed off, like... Um, fuck, I can't think of what I was 
was going to say. You were saying, this is sacred ground. Yeah. You yeah, trespassing kind of fucks and so and so. <laughs> this so. land is under my protection. This land was made <laughs> for me and you. all will die. <laughs> just me. <laughs> Actually, you know that I think about it. Just me. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and I have also got to do my... <laughs> your pivot, your gyration. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Smoochie, like, he can see that. Uh, he, he, like, trips at his step a little bit as he's rushing towards there. But, yeah, he's he's heading off towards the, <laughs> the nearest group. And the Chaos Company and Zyko very close behind him. Um, so, Willem, you have readied your your blindness. Are mm-hmm. you going to cast it on the lump? Yeah. Okay. Uh, what is the save? Uh, Constitution 18. Ooh. All right. So, uh, so it succeeds. Okay. Um, it grabs hold. All right. So... Uh he is blinded now okay. uh, for the duration, which is one minute. Okay. Uh, at the end of each of his turns, he can make a constitution saving throw. Uh, upon success, the spell would end. Okay. And you have a... F- f- oh, next turn. Mm-hmm. The free action yep. turn. Mm-hmm. So, Pinwin. Mm-hmm. We did everybody, right? Yep. Pinwin, it's back to you. All so, right. all of this has just happened... Um, so there's a lot of chaos right now. You have 15 feet more speed, and you have another action you can do. Yeah, and this spell is a bonus action every round. So Whoa. that's... Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's concentration, right? Is so it? You, yeah, so you can't cast any other concentration spells. But I could shoot my bow. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So Yeah, it is concentration. Okay, so I'm going to take out my oath bow and... Have I had a favorite enemy to Mm-mm. You already no. have advantage on him. Cause if oh, that's right. It would just give you more hit. More damage, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Favored enemy. Enemy favored. The bow sings back. Yeah. And then he is going to get hurt. Good to be a halfling. <laughs> uh, okay. If only you were like that in real life. I know. <laughs> right? Okay. So then that would be, oh, that went up. 39. 39. Holy to hit. You what? hit. Mm-hmm. How? It's Thanks. plus 13, right? 13 plus 16? 29. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> like, what? Yeah. I just took it as face value. I was like, okay, yeah. probably. Yeah, what kind kidding. of D24 do you have over there? <laughs> cool. So no, 29. 29. Okay. Yeah. And then. That hits. Yay. So then. D8, and then 3D6. Fuck. Cool. You got all six. All six. <laughs> Holy shit. So, Damn. The devil is coming <laughs> So hey, seven. Hell, so drag him back to hell. Seven plus 18. 25? 25. Yeah. So 25 damage. I can do it twice because I have two turns. You can, yep. Well, you, you have, have a two free attacks action, per yeah. action, and then you have a free action. You should, after so you can attack four times. Yeah. Shoot him four times. Okay. <laughs> and you have advantage. So, uh, ab- oh, that's he's right. gonna I fucking didn't... die before anyone <laughs> attacks me. So, uh, I do have advantage. I forgot. I don't think I even know that. Okay, so that would be thirteen plus th- twenty-six. Yeah, that hits. So, Pinwin's first attack. Sh- it looked like a pretty rough one because you hear like a 10 20 okay 20 mm-hmm. all right sweet and so then... yeah second attack just you're <laughs> right into the, you see two arrows sticking out of this cloth lump all right and then i'm going to as my bonus action command my objects to kind of come and strike our lump okay our lumpy friend um so in the spell, does it say if you're targeting anything with that? If, the, if there's like, like a plus to anything? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Okay. I've got it written down. There's All right, stats sweet. here. All right. So, for large pole. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus fuck. Eighteen. Eighteen. All right. That, does that hit? Yeah, you have you would have advantage because oh. you have a light. Even the objects have advantage. Oh my god. Oh no. Eighteen. So eighteen does not hit. The. <laughs> the it sticks right next to the <laughs> it's my first time it's kind of heavy I'm like, ah. um okay so next up is medium table <laughs> with advantage <Okay. laughs> 
<laughs> medium so table. Medium that table. 23? That hits. <laughs> so the table just... <laughs> 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 okay, so there's seven Christ damage. The <laughs> oh, wait, right. eight. Christ eight. Christ eight. One. All right. <laughs> and then two small swords. Oh, no. <laughs> So. With advantage. Am I rolling both of them? Yeah. Okay. So, 16 plus 6. That hits. Yep. Okay. And then, so I'll roll this twice. 6. 6. So, 12. Okay. And then, two small spikes. All right. <laughs> <laughs> this dude's about to get yeah. uh, Oh, my God. He's going to regret being a... With advantage, so you also get alive. to shoot him twice more. Yeah, 19, 19 plus six, so twenty. <laughs> yeah, twenty-five to hit. Yes. Okay, that hits. Six. Okay. Fuck. Holy fuck! <laughs> All right. So you guys watch Pinwin, and then miss, but then a table, and then two swords, right in these, and then two spikes. <laughs> Guys, I and don't that's think a I bonus need to be here. Yeah. Yeah, so you get another action. You all got this. There? Yeah, I'm just going to go get an Italian ice. Okay. <laughs> we need ooh, to make sure, ooh, though, because that sounds Perfect. way OP, is it? Yeah, so all these <laughs> items just... <laughs> 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 all right. You got hit with a table. <laughs> Smoochie. Um, so I'm going to run up, and I'm going to start swinging away. Okay. So he's going to start cleaving through these soldiers. And, and he has a lot of stuff, items he, that help him to, yeah. once he kills, he And they're all, he's also going to have advantage because most of them are now distracted by this giant fucking wind turbine that's ripping their ranks apart. Yeah. So. And his crits are on a 19 and 20 now with his axe. So go ahead and give me um, at the first attack roll with advantage. <laughs> They were all watching The Shining at a drive-in, and then all of a sudden a whirlwind just comes <laughs> yeah. in and fucks shit Twister. up. <laughs> that was a really bad roll. Why did I have an advantage? Because they're distracted. Their backs are turned to you. Oh. 16 for the first one. I mean, it's going to hit right oh, in there. Nice. So these are just general so, rabble. So go ahead and, yeah, roll. General rabble? <laughs> Reporting 1D for duty. 12. When you've been watching eight, How I Met Your so Mother. No. 12 damage <laughs> plus no. 4 for rage. Mm -hmm. So 16 damage. Okay. For the first. Jeez, that's bad. 8 plus 13. 21. 21, which would hit. Okay. And then 11 plus 8. 19, 23 damage. 23 damage. One. Okay. So, yeah, Smoochie runs in and he just starts slicing into these guys. And he's going to start, like, cleaving through. And we'll come back to him in a moment. Um, Willem, you have you cast Blindness. Now what are you going to do? I'm just going to fire at Burnus here. Okay. All right, so. He's still kind Don't of trapped in the friend. tent, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, he's still fucking just underneath there. You hit. <laughs> Are you firing with an, an arrow, a normal arrow, or yeah, just a normal? You have arrow. advantage okay, yeah. too, so. Yep. Oh yeah, roll again, just in case it's a crit. It's not, but sweet. Yeah. <laughs> so super hit. All right. So yeah, I uh, knock a normal arrow. I'm not gonna use because uh, I'm using spider bow. Mm -hmm. Not gonna use one of my my spider arrows. Um, and I shoot at Burnus. Okay. Uh, or the lump that we assume yeah. is Burnus. Yeah. Nothing you uh, you hit. That has two arrows sticking out of it. <laughs> two, two arrows, two spikes, two spikes, a broken <laughs> table. <laughs> <laughs> just hit him real hard. Yeah, he got fucked. Okay. Um. <laughs> just calmly sitting in a tent. <laughs> <laughs> go, go, go! What the fuck? And his world came crashing down on him. And seven. <laughs> All right, sweet. So your first... Seven damage mm -hmm. plus yep. sneak attack. Yep, plus sneak attack. So go ahead and roll your d6s or d8s or whatever. Oh shit! I was just gonna say that. Thank you. <laughs> You're That's why it's just great to let be a rogue. Get back, get by with just seven. No, damage. I was just I was just about to say sneak oh, attack. Okay. <laughs> I want a little more damn. drama though, <laughs> and sneak attack. All right. Oof. Damn. You are sneaky as hell. <laughs> <laughs> and so that's. Colorful. Five. Yeah, it is. I like it. Eleven. Twelve. 
12, 18, 22. Yeah, that's 22. good when you hit with it. <laughs> <laughs> so, damn. <laughs> so, 7 plus 22, um, which is really awesome. So, he's <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, He's not having a good time. And then you have another action. Well, shit. <laughs> I thought that was Did you put away your do. dice? Yeah. <laughs> You're going to take them out every time you sneak a deck? You know, it's just habit. I like, let I like to let be him cleanly. get used to it. He's, I like to be cleanly. He's still learning. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'm gonna mosey then uh, around to like kind of circumvent okay. uh, the parameter. Circumvent. Cir- cir- circumcise. You have 15 extra. Circumvent. I do have movement. 15 extra feet. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> gonna get up on behind that motherfucker. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. Her stag. He gets another attack. Oh yeah, you haven't done it yet. Your movement is not a movement. Yeah, know. that wouldn't yeah. be an action. So you well, Jesus still... Christ! All right, I'm just gonna sh- light this motherfucker <laughs> up again <laughs> with advantage. Mm. All right. Nice. Mm. So yeah, I'm assuming that's a hit. That hits. <laughs> All right, and rolling damage. And that's no, sne- nine. no sneak attack. No sneak attack yeah. this time. Didn't think so. All right, so nine. Nine damage. All right, so Willem hits him with an arrow. Then I like to think he's, like, aiming as he's running around the tent. <laughs> yeah, that could, that could be really cool. So, yeah, the second... I'm not telling you that. No, no, no. <laughs> doing, doing, like, the anime run, like the... T- <laughs> yeah, he's just aiming at him. Like uh, Ashitaka. Like, <laughs> yes, exactly. And then he gets to this point and releases. He lines up his shot, it zips right past Tomar. So and it's just, now sh- on the back side of him, too. He's like, <laughs> <laughs> All right, her stag. He's well, a bad day. I'm going <laughs> to fuck some shit up with my whirlwind. Okay. So that'll be like, what was it? Fuck. 10d6, I think. Okay, go ahead and give me some rolls. Did Smoochie do whirlwind? No, no. But her stag. You do? He started chopping into people. Yeah, he just oh, chops right. stuff. <laughs> He's a right. choppy guy. Yeah. Yeah, so it's 10d6. Um, you can make a dex save if you want, 19. For group, group. of enemies. Nope, no save. Sweet. <laughs> Fuck is 9. Oh, 13, 14, 15. <laughs> Make a 10. 27, right? 15 so 10, plus 12 7, is 27. 17, 18, 19. Show off. Because 6 plus 4 is 10. Fuck, you fucked me up. Again. And then 10 plus 7, 17. And 17 plus 2 is 19. What was my first roll, though? Who cares? It's a lot. Does a shit ton of damage. <laughs> shit ton of damage. So these soldiers are... And some of them are... <laughs> flying yeah. out of the top. Don't count. <laughs> Sorry, that's lo- Math is fun sometimes when all I, of my, my brain's first cooperating. Dice. <laughs> okay, so um, yeah, you did that like surprisingly fast. Yeah, that's a nineteen. <laughs> but then I lost all my yeah. first five dice. <laughs> and then he's like, oh, fuck. <laughs> you have um, another action. Yeah. So oh what yeah. Do? Fuck. I'm gonna do it again. All right. <laughs> I'll say I'll save you some forth. rolling. You're gonna you're gonna hit him and you're gonna do some damage. You're basically doing all the Six. crowd control. So you're basically like like they're getting trapped in this thing. Okay. And they have nowhere that they can like hold on to, so they're definitely getting picked up by it. All right. Um Gorbel, it's your turn. So that's the group over there that's swirling around. Yeah, way way off. Like over Are there any other clusters of people? Uh, there I should mean, be not a, nearby a bunch guys. because the whirlwind is only like a, it's a 10-foot radius, mm-hmm. so it takes up like that much space. Mm-hmm. I think him and, but saying, it's like moving around. I think stuff. we're good with the crowd. Yeah. Because we have the whole chaos company over there and, and Smoochie and Psycho yeah. and Smoochie. Yeah. I think we need to kill You guys this don't have any soldiers guy. near nearby you at the moment. Well <laughs> okay. You have a shit ton of movement you could get over. I mean he was you. saying they were made of paper. He's yeah. essentially saying I'm not focusing and on I'm them. And I'm not seeing any other nope. people around. Well, this is kind of lame. <laughs> okay, fine. Do you want to um, drop some elite guards in there, Seth, to make just, it harder? Why don't for you guys us? just wait? <laughs> oh, just no. take a beat. Uh, oh no! Yeah, n- none of the bad guys have gone yet. So. <laughs> okay. Um. Summons a kraken. <laughs> he is a kraken. <laughs> <laughs> oh! 
<laughs> How far can I move up without using an action? You're 60 plus 15. Yeah, so 85. Okay, well, I'm going to run up 75. to... <laughs> Why does everyone suck at that? I'm going to run up to 10, dude. <laughs> okay, so you run across the canvas there to the lump? Mm-hmm. I touch the lump. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and I'm That's going to cast lump. Bestow Curse. Okay. Here you go, buddy. <laughs> Aww. What's the uh, save on that? Ni- Wisdom 19. Okay. And 19? 19. Mm-hmm. Nice. Wait, nice what is team. it? 19? Oh, your proficiency too. went up, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> and what curse are you going to attempt to bestow? Small dick. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so. It gets bigger. <laughs> Um, I'm going to do. Remember, you can also select one that's not on the list. I know. I'm going to have them. Uh, I mean, I have him take an extra one d eight necrotic damage. Okay. For attacks and spells, but it says your attacks and spells, so it's just mine. Yeah. Okay. And does it have to be a spell that deals necrotic damage? Or? No, it's, it's just it, bonus. Yeah, it's just, yeah. So. Okay. Okay. All right, so you've bestowed curse on him. Now you have another action. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's see what I'm going to do. I'm going to cast... That is every time you hit him too, right? So, yeah. yeah. So if you were to chop him with a I'm sword... Gonna, yeah, I'm going to chop that motherfucker because I can chop him twice. Yep. Mm-hmm. And you have oh, advantage. is that a concentration? No, it's a best- you bestow curse. Like, it's just there. If they don't save. Does it come with concentration? I don't think so. Check the top of the spell. Oh, my God, I am. Let me get back there. <laughs> It's I. Okay, very, yes, I, it is concentration. Is it? Ah. Damn. All right. So ah. no more fairy fire. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I'm going to double attack with my wolf blood blade. Okay, so you're going to attack with advantage. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Okay, that is 28 to hit. That first Ooh. attack hits. Damn. Go ahead and roll your second attack just because you have it out. Just. Win and roll. Hmm. <laughs> she can do a total of four. Total of four? Is she? Wait. Well, no, wait, no. She already she cast, cast a, spell. a spell. Yep, never mind. Shut up, Elijah. 19 Sorry. to hit. 19 <laughs> hits. So both attacks will hit. So go ahead and roll okay. damage. And he's going to have to roll. Any blade flourishes? Oh, you could do more, yeah. I keep forgetting how. It's uh, yeah, you use a bardic flourish, inspiration. Yeah, 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 mobile flourish, defensive flourish, and uh. Oh, I have to use a bardic inspo. Mm-hmm. I do it. Okay, so yeah, which one are you gonna use? Each one does something. <laughs> each one does something different. I've been waiting for this. Maybe pause it. Yeah. I've been waiting. You add your bardic inspiration. <laughs> to come in. You can add your bardic inspiration oh, dice as damage. Whenever you take the attack action on your turn, your walking speed increases by 10 feet until the end of the turn. If a weapon attack hits, you can expend one of your bardic inspiration die to deal extra damage equal to the number you roll on the die to the target you hit and to any other creature within five feet of you. So get ready, Tomar. <laughs> so as you're within five is feet your, of you. I moved you to his back. I didn't want to be this bag. You want to slash Tomar too? I'm just kidding. You don't no. get advantage. I don't want to <laughs> slash Tomar. Um, so roll your inspiration die, which is, are they D10s now? Yes. Okay. And that'll be your extra damage there. It's an eight. Okay. Now roll damage for the attacks. Okay. Nine, ten. 17. Wait, don't you get pluses to your attack? 25 damage. damage. Oh, 25 damage. Gotcha. Okay. Isn't there poison and stuff on that Yes, and I rolled and he did not resist, so add the poison damage as well. D6. Is this one sword attack? No, this is both. This is both. Oh, Mm -hmm. okay. It's like Dave. Two. And he's getting poisoned again? Mm Mm-hmm. Six. Oh, plus additional necrotic damage. Oh, that's 1d8. Holy oh, shit. my God. 
So you got the eight mm -hmm. extra yep. for poison, and then six necrotic. Jesus How much fuck. damage was that? In uh, one round? 38. You might as fuck. well do your orcish fury, too. <laughs> 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 Just whip out all the stuff you haven't been mm -hmm. using. <laughs> I turn to Tomar. I mean, as long as I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do some Orcish Fury. I think that gives you a whole extra damage dice for oh a one God. hit. You can roll one <laughs> okay. of the weapon's damage dice an additional time and add it as extra damage. So would I get the wow. plus to that, or would it just be I think it's ten? just the die. It's one, uh, just it, one yeah, more damage. It's just the damage. Yep. Uh, the dice d damage. Your sword damage. So it... I would still get like the plus four, so it would be like one d ten plus four. No, it'd just be the d10. just the dice. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. Nine. <laughs> fuck yeah. Yes. Jesus fuck. <laughs> Forty seven damage. damage. So God you guys. Damn. So Tomar, you have a frontline seat as she puts her hand out, casts something on him, and then just starts. <laughs> Like she just fucking lays into him. She does like a cool little fucking slashing like foot maneuver thing and switches switches onto the off foot and then just keeps slashing. You just hear like blah, 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 underneath the tent. <laughs> hey, you're pretty good with a blade. Who would have thought? I and know, then I'm right? gonna start chopping into him. <laughs> Wait. What? The enemies have to fight back? <laughs> <laughs> yes. So you guys watch. You two see you and you Gorbel and you Tomar see the lump disappear and you hear like a <laughs> sound the fuck you guys are now like looking at each other <laughs> and it's silent for just a moment did you chop him into jelly I I don't know and then you hear a <laughs> <laughs> and right behind Willem he re emerges from the ground explodes <laughs> Full force? Does he look healthy? <laughs> <laughs> he looks pretty healthy, but he looks pissed uh -oh. off. Well, he's a burrower. We got a burrower. Fuck, mole man. We got a diglet. <laughs> but being right behind you, Willem, you can you can feel like the explosion of the air and the rock right okay. behind you, and you like can kind of turn and see. He takes a step back, and he's got a big spear in his hand. Oh shit. And it almost looks like he's going to go for you, but instead he stabs it right into the ground, and you guys Ooh, watch I don't like it. as the like magical rivulets start going up and down this spear, and the spear itself, a little cone of magic forms around it. Does anyone have counterspell? Yes! Wait. It's a reaction. No metagaming. Come it's on, guys. I mean, she need, I mean, she need, she need. if he's casting yeah. a spell. Yeah. I mean, I mean go ahead. If you're gonna <laughs> fucking ruin his narrative. Yeah. If you guys are going to fucking metagame, no more metagaming. Just remember you guys, what you guys have. Well, no yeah, more. but I'm just going to let him, like, describe just it. Just do your thing. <laughs> he's all thing. mad. Okay, I'm going to have to I'm just to mad about the metagaming. <laughs> I mean, if I had she would spell, know I she had But she spell. wasn't going to use it, is what I'm saying. I How do you fucking know I wasn't going to use it? True. Use it? I mean, yes. You were. <laughs> and if she were didn't actually? use it, I think I have. All I'm saying is it's really hard for me to know if you were going to use it when somebody says, use this. Okay, I mean, I said it really quickly. What if the person says I was going to use it? All I'm saying is that to me, that's medical. Are you saying you don't trust no. your girlfriend? No. All I'm saying is that <laughs> this, go ahead and use it, but this nobody isn't the metagaming. This of metagaming. I'm, I will say that. All I'm saying is if you're going to use it, use it. No more metagame. <laughs> if it's not yours, don't say it. Okay, so do I like not get to use it now because. No, you can use it. Do I have to deal with that tone? <laughs> no, go ahead. I'm over it. <laughs> but I will say in the future, you're please shut it. the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> That's fear. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, ta -ta 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 the DC equals 10 plus the spell's level. On a success, the creature's spell fails and has no effect. Okay. So, so what level are you going to cast counter spell at? Fifth. Okay. Using a spell slot of fourth level or higher, the interrupted spell has no effect if its level is less than or equal to the level of the spell slot you use. 
Okay, so you cast Counterspell. And the magical, basically, field around this spear disappears. Woo. Nice. Ow. You kind of <laughs> took the wind out of my sails. <laughs> you took the wind out of my sails. No. <laughs> um, okay, so the it disperses. And the spear is just sticking out of the ground behind you now, Willem. Okay. And it is and now your turn, Tomar. He's just standing there like, Will? <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> Don't I go before him? You, the curb no, we're enthusiasm. still in that first <laughs> we're round. We're still? Yeah. Oh, my God. You guys got a lot of extra actions. Yeah, whoa. So with my burst of speed that I normally don't have, I'm going to run up behind him. Okay. Do you still have the speed? I thought you said for one Ten round. rounds. Whoa. Ten rounds you can do an extra you, action? You, no, oh, no. That's just the first action. Okay. And then you the, get the speed you, for ten rounds. I rolled on the dimension die to determine how many rounds we had the extra speed. Oh, okay. I going to say OP. <laughs> do I have advantage because I'm behind him? Well, if you're moving behind him, yeah. So, um, 28, 28, <laughs> Jesus fuck, 28, 28, oh my God. <laughs> holy fuck, okay, so all three attacks hit, I'm gonna use this one instead, 28, 14, you no, wait, do, 15, and you do notice that he appears to, his eyes appear clouded, as if magically, because he's still blinded. I see that from the back of his head. And when you were moving over there. <laughs> Anyone who was looking. 15, 16. Um, and then 13 damage. 15, 16, and 13. Okay. But but he's blinded still, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. So I'm not going to do the bonus action thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How is this guy still? 44. Hey. Damn. <laughs> Lindsay, you just became the guy from Limitless. <laughs> Basic man. <laughs> the, the calculations floating everywhere. No, it, it's common core. Oh. So it, it works. Tends. My favorite. It does. Subgenre of metal core. <laughs> <laughs> common core. That's what the peasants do. Um, okay, so. Uh, okay. Lewin. Is going to Eat die. A <laughs> run up to him as well. And eat a cheeseburger and die. Why are you pausing? I was waiting to see where it was going. <laughs> oh, go. gosh. Um, oh, man. And is going to slash with her blade. Hopefully, the enemy. <laughs> Never mind. She misses with the first attack, second attack. Are you oh. rolling at advantage? Oh, shit, no. She doesn't get advantage at the side. Oh. But you're flanking. But he's still blinded. She, She's not. Oh. Aren't you flanking? You get advantage against people that are blinded? Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah, you do. Mm-hmm. Shit. He's right. Good job, newbie. <laughs> <laughs> I know some things. <laughs> okay, so one of the attacks hits. Her first one misses. Her second one strikes true. And she has a little bit of damage. Mm. And that's it. <laughs> um, no green flame blade? No green flame blade at the moment. That would have hit both of you. And um, now you guys see off to the side, everybody's starting to make short work of these soldiers. And um, Pinwin, it's your turn. Okay. So with Oathbow... Mm-hmm. Do I have disadvantage right um, now if I were trying? Yeah, because you don't him? have a line of sight. Because it says well, it's it would just be it would just be regular, yeah. Okay. Because you have advantage with oath bow. Because yeah, it but just, this would cancel it out. So it, it just, just normal. says your target gains no benefit from cover. Other oh. Then total cover. No, that's that not total means. cover. So yeah, then you can then you're then you would still have advantage. How do I? How did we miss that like the entire time? I didn't remember that at all. I think it's never been a thing. I, I think I've we, known it. We haven't worried much about cover before. Right. That's true. Yeah. We should, though. Fuck yeah. I critted. <laughs> you critted? Yeah. Damn. Shit. All right. So there's one shot. Then. So that hits. 
Okay. Yeah. Yeah, duh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I rolled the highest you could possibly roll. You miss. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's one of Mike Wright's <laughs> enemies. Okay, so max damage is 3d6, 18. Mm-hmm. Plus, plus a d8. D8 plus 5. Okay, so 13. 15 plus 13, so 28. 28, 28 yeah. plus... <laughs> 28 plus 7 plus 4 is 11 plus 6 plus 17. So 28 plus 17. 44. 5? 28 plus 7? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay, 44? Okay, so Pinwin lines up a shot as well. That's 45. That would have been a 45. You were right. It was 5. Yeah. So it almost like snakes through and just... Hits him right in his chest, like, Aah! and again. And <laughs> <laughs> it's good to be a halfling, though. Okay, so that would be thirty. Thirty hits. Okay. Yeah, thirteen plus fifteen, twenty-eight. Twenty-eight. Fuck All right. Christ. Jesus. Fuck. So he he's ah. Uh, and it, like the arrow hits very close to the same spot. He's like right here. Like, <laughs> and then he snaps off the end of it. And um, um, we won't worry about Smoochie right now. And <laughs> I'm animating objects. I'm going to have them all just like kind of sink to the side and then plop, and like come back and <laughs> All right. The side. Go ahead and roll. Okay. To see if you hit with them. So large pulls turn. Nope. Advantage. Oh. He's blind. <laughs> 18. 18. Yeah. All right, that hits. No, wait, no, it doesn't. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it didn't the first time either. Large pull, be better. <laughs> Fuck. Table. Medium. Yep, medium table, 20. 20 hits. Hey. <laughs> we know it's a medium table because there's a crystal ball on it. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Five experience. Wacka, wacka. <laughs> I liked medium it. Table. Okay, so seven damage there. Seven damage, all right. And then two small swords. I feel like this is uh, 12 days of Christmas, and you have to remember each thing. (laughs) (laughs) Two small swords and a couple of pointy stakes. Okay, so 16 plus 6, 23. To hit? Yep. Yep, you hit. And seven and... Three, so ten. Ten, all right. Small sword. Jesus, fuck, Ben. What? And then two small spikes. Jesus. I critted with the spikes. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> but all right, max I mean, damage plus whatever you roll for the spikes. This is like. So that would be twenty together collectively for both spikes. Because they're ten each for max damage. One d eight plus two. Oh, okay. Do you roll for right. each spike or just one? I've been rolling since. I guess is that okay? I've been just for conserving time. I've been rolling. Yeah, that's fine. It's them grouping together. them together. All right, so ten plus. Now roll the two uh, d eights as well again. Okay. Oh my god! You did over. It would have been. Damage. It would have yeah. been twenty because it's two run. spikes that critted. Then that's the what way I she's said. Doing it. Yeah. 20. Oh shit! So that's 20 what I said. Plus, plus the two d eights. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that's what I said. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> I okay, said ten. So ten each plus. Oh, I meant twenty. Okay. But yeah. Oh, wait. Listen to what Five. I mean, not what I say, <laughs> Elijah. Yeah. So how much? Plus 15. Jesus, fuck. Yep, that was so over. 20 plus 15, so 35? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yep, that so. was over 100 damage in one round. Jesus Christ. Yeah! Oh, yeah. That was 115 damage. 16 damage in one round. Christ. Hot dog. This dog. dude is still alive? <laughs> yeah. He's, so, yeah, you guys... So... Th- Two arrows, he, oh, but he's still blinded. And then the the big pole misses again. Funk. It, it's a bit unwieldy. But then the table comes flying and cracks him. And he's like, oh! <laughs> then two swords slice him. I like to picture the tables like WWE, like up there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, just, I was just imagining it come flying, like bait, like the flat side right at him <laughs> at an angle. Yep. And then the two spikes. And they're like in him now, right in his arm. But yeah, he's still alive. What the fuck is this guy, <laughs> Willem? All right, so I am going to 
uh, essentially you, disengage. You can bonus action disengage yeah. as a rogue, I think. Yep. Uh, it's a cunning action, I believe. Uh, so I'll disengage, and I'm going to get some distance between us. You get extra 15 feet. Yep. Okay. There we go. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to take a shot at this dude. Okay. Shot, 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 shot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that is an. You have advantage. I have he's advantage because he's blind. So that is a 20. That hits. Sorry. Uh, 19. That hits. Okay. Sweet. <laughs> uh, and since he's. This is is would this be considered a sneak attack because he's blind? I would, it would be a sneak fr- attack the because they're we have allies advantage. within five feet. Oh, sweet! You'd also get advantage based on that too. Excellent. Okay. Bes- besides the blindness. Okay. So he's so, he's all disadvantaged basically. He just, <laughs> yeah. He's not having a good time at all. All right. So I hit him with that shit. Fuck yeah. Uh-huh. Uh So nine. All right. Wait. Plus your. He's doing it. Yep. He's doing oh, okay. Gotcha. Just keep him out of the bag. I will now. <laughs> <laughs> you know, sometimes you fuck around. You keep him out of the bag. <laughs> you, know, you know, sometimes you're just a fucking idiot. Bro. Why are you so stupid? <laughs> keep him out of the bag, bro. All right. So we've got 9, 10, 19, 22. 22, Jesus. All right. Ooh. Plus the 9, right? Yes, sir. Okay. All right. So, Willem... Hops back, lining up his shot, fires, and it just gets him right here in the center of the chest, right in his sternum, just right in, into his breastplate. Uh, and he's like, uh, uh, snap again. What a badass. Um, her stag. Um, <laughs> just gonna whirlwind them some more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> just gonna shake that shit up. Uh, five, seven. Plus uh, 13. Um, 24. 27. 27? All right. And their deck save is 19. <laughs> was it a 20? No, it was a 5. five. Oh. <laughs> I'm, gi- I'm giving them all general like plus twos. Um, so yeah, like so yeah. five, five guys or so yeah, more just die. <laughs> They're just flying out into the forest. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Gorble. Hmm. Sorry, this is a tough call for me. So many choices. We're fucking shit up. I mean, this is fun. I don't know. We've lit this dude up, and he's just not slowing down. Yeah. Yeah, something's up with this dude. I'm waiting for. I've so. I've been. Like we're the fucking doing the Final Still, Fantasy Tactics thing, up and, it's and cool. like every time you have like a boss fight with a guy, you're just like, yeah, fuck that normal guy, and then all of a sudden he's just like, oh, by the way, I have, the, not normal. I have one of those zodiac stones. <laughs> fucking not normal. He's a demon. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah. Balls. Oh, I'm a demon. Final um, Fantasy Tactics is so fucking tight. God damn it! I just don't know. Well, you and cast like, your he- curse on him. He's you like, still have extra damage for hitting him. Mm-hmm. What were you well, say? if you do damaging spells, it'll still do it. Is he <laughs> still holding a spear? Uh, it's in the ground. He's not touching it. Mm-mm. Okay. Fine. Good. Whatever. <laughs> Fine. I'm Talk going to do... He does have armor. Shut the oh. fuck up. God damn it. For all I know, she wasn't even Elijah, what did I just say? She was what I was thinking about doing. (laughs) Elijah, seriously. Shut your fucking mouth. It's our crawl. You'd still do way more damage with the sword than you would with the Oh my god. Is this card just like going back and forth? They're drag racing. Okay, fine. If one more person metagames, I'm taking away experience. (laughs) That's fair. (laughs) I'll allow it. Because it also takes away her agency from figuring out what she wants to do. Well, are you pausing it while like she's like obviously heat metal was so what I, I was doing. I, I'm just saying because I, I thought we were allow like, someone okay. to. She if, thought she couldn't do metal because he dropped a spear, but you described that he has armor on. Yeah, 
I understand. But all, also what I'm saying is that when someone jumps in with a suggestion, that immediately removes the agency just, uh, from somebody. Just let her decide I, what to okay. do. I know. I'm just, I'm He's talking trying about, to. yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to say that just let somebody do their thing. That way I don't have to be like, stop doing that. If I cast heat metal on my blade, will it do extra damage to him? You will damage yourself. Yeah, because you, you're, you're holding onto the blade. I'm not holding onto the blade. Well, you're holding that's, onto the sword. So that's just how yeah. heat metal works. Yeah, it heats if the you're entire object. A weapon, you're... No, because in the past, you didn't let me do that because I heated somebody else's weapon, and you were like, nope, because the handle something No, that's because that? uh, no, Elijah that's did. That's never. Elijah said a bullshit is the handle metal, and we were like, shut up, Elijah. No, you didn't let me do it. <laughs> Didn't I? No, yeah. he yeah. let you do it. No. no. Uh, but yeah, the way the spell works, the weapon would get hot and burn their hand. And I don't remember anything about that. I don't remember it. But Thank you very much. <laughs> she obviously does. So I like it. We're going to fight about it later. <laughs> okay, fine. Whatever. I'll just go attack him. Okay. Not funny. <laughs> How, well, you get to hit him. That's fun. <laughs> Pinata. Advantage or nah? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He's blinded. Exactly the same. Okay, um, that is 25 to hit. That hits. And I'll just roll again. Twenty-three to hit. That also hits. Okay. So roll a he save, is so. going to do. I'm going to just go ahead and do the extra eight necrotic damage, Mm -hmm. the D8. Okay, Okay, seven. Seven, nice. Keep that in the back of your mind. I wrote it (laughs) down. Good thinking. Okay. So that's 10. And 12. All right. So 10, 12, so 22. All right, so a total of 29 damage. And then... Does he make the poison oh, save shit. twice? Yes, both times. We'll just go with 17. Okay. He saves. <laughs> um, so yeah, so Gorble runs up, <laughs> chops him twice. He tries to like bring up his his uh, kind of his glaive to, to block it, but she just chops right in, starts chipping away at the armor. And now it is Burnus's turn. He's glares at you since you're the most recent person. Oh, no, he doesn't because <laughs> he can't see who is in front of him. <laughs> you can do a con save. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do right now. And he doesn't save. So he, you see him reach out slightly and again grabs his spear and it starts to glow and a um little cone of magic. Does he like reach for it a few times and miss? <laughs> it's like fingertips. I found it. <laughs> <laughs> and this cone comes down. Are you counter counterspelling again? Well, I'm metagaming, <laughs> Seth. Ugh. Dirty metagamer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. If, so if he's blind... I'm gonna fight everyone. <laughs> okay, I have a question. Yes. I know. If he's blind and we can see him like grabbing for the spear, unless you're just saying that he like reaches out and it's a perfect. Well, I, you it's guys like just like it's right in front of him. He so was hit by it, like a I table. Just, I thought it would be shit, funny though. if he like had to do that, but not in a way that would like give him disadvantage or anything like that. Just as, as a flavor. Not thing. even like a little opportunity. I mean, that's not a reaction. It, thing. He, it would be yeah. I just for flavor purposes, he gets he's to just trying to touch. He try he like reaches out. Oh, oh here it is. And then the little cone comes down. And. Does it? Okay, I'm counterspelling. <laughs> I'm gonna use all my fucking spell slots on this. Dumb He's a boss guy. guy. You don't have to. He's maybe maybe guy. this is gonna be really cool. Yeah, maybe. I'm sure it's gonna work out yeah, great I mean, for us. <laughs> I, well, I mean, at this point, we're fucking <laughs> shit up. I, I'd be okay to take some damage to see yeah. a cool last spell. <laughs> I mean, you're take me some out of hell yeah. <laughs> Do what you're going to do, Gorble. I'm still going to do yeah. this guy. <laughs> okay, what level are you casting? I'm casting it at third. At third? Mm-hmm. Okay. Natural 20. <laughs> Woo! Nice. Dude. All right, it is dispelled. <laughs> 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 so, <laughs> shh. You just hear him, fuck. 
<laughs> <laughs> Shit, that's my one card. <laughs> He's not going to get one lick in. <laughs> All right, Tomar, it's your turn. Unless he's immune to all damage. Maybe he is. We don't know. He's just Can we tell if he's been, like... Give me an insight check. Or a medicine check, I guess, would be better. If this has been an illusion this whole time, oh my <laughs> God. I'm going to be so mad. This illusion <laughs> is, like, so 18. dead. Uh, he's been taking some damage. Okay. You can actually, you can see some blood having formed. Okay, so, um, 27... Natural 20. Okay. Okay. We're rolling a lot of crits. And then 26. 27, 26. Okay, roll the damage for the first two. Those are just attacks. <laughs> I, I like it, though. Mm. Um, nine. Twelve. And then the crit is... 19 plus Ooh. 7 26 plus since it's steel song on a critical hit this weapon deals bonus radiant damage 5 47 damage so Tomar and we'll say that third attack was just like a and you actually like hit him so good that his ear goes flying off <laughs> and he, he just has this like big nice like slice through the side of his head he's like oh fuck oh. <laughs> and his ear is nowhere to be seen <laughs> <laughs> so if he lives that's gonna be a scar <laughs> all right um that's gonna be a lewin is also going to attack him it hits and second attack does not hit so the first attack advantage Oh, yep, you're right. Does not hit. Lewin isn't flanking. He's blind. He's still Fuck. blind. I keep forgetting. Dumbass. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so many things going on. It's actually pretty good. <laughs> you're making a really stupid face. <laughs> well, I was trying to add, like do mental math. <laughs> six plus six plus five plus eight. Twenty plus five. Twenty five. <laughs> All right. So, I was like, wait. Is that nice it? job, Lewin. So she doesn't say anything as she slices him with the Nodaichi. All right. And now it is Pinwin's turn. I'm, I'm going to try to shoot him again. Whoa. Um, I don't think I want to hit then. Plus 13. 18? No. Does not hit. First time. That's going to hit. Well, rolled the same thing two times, both times. Okay, so 18 plus 13. It hits. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And Willem, you're going to be on deck. Plus five, nine plus 16. 16 plus nine, 25. Okay, 25. You guys are doing a lot of 25 damages yeah. to him. And then animate objects. Okay, <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> I'll just have them attack. How much damage has this guy taken? So much. A f- metric well, fuck ton. Yeah, Pinwin did over 100 in one round. 321 right now. <sighs> what? Yes. This he's, guy is not a normal guy. Is he a god? <laughs> he's <laughs> a god. Hey, he's a demon. Hey, he's a demon. Ah, oh, fucking large pool. Get your shit together. <laughs> so... I, I actually was... like that it's key. It just, <laughs> it's just, just like bumbling fucking like. <coughs> I'd like to imagine I'm like, yeah. And that would have done like 2d10 damage, so he could have been doing way more damage yeah, this whole time. Yeah, it would have been dope. But the pole keeps missing. Yep, so, yeah, 8 plus 6, no. <laughs> I feel like the pole's gonna get the final Okay, medium blow. table. I hope so. It just fucking goes back into is the ground. Is it advantage? <laughs> Underneath like, him, yeah. Like, oh, is it advantage? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Let me try a table again. You're blind. Oh, <laughs> on the table. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I the table. Wow. <laughs> that's table, the you third got your day. No, that Daddy was the pole, that right? That is my third one. You were one. redoing the yeah. pole. Wait, yeah. that's the pole? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So 20 plus 2d10. Oh, damn. I thought you guys were saying bowl for so a second. So is it <laughs> for like this whole round? Should I was like, I didn't know there party? was a bowl in there. <laughs> so is it 2d10 plus whatever I rolled? 
So it would be 20 it's plus, 20 plus, and then roll 2d10s. Plus. Actually, 22 because it's 2d10 plus 2. Oh, okay, it is. so 22 and then roll plus. roll okay. the d10s. Oh my god, I never use a d10. Is this 10? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Love those. Fuck it. 3 and 6. So 9. Plus 2 for each. So 11. So 31. 30, 31, yep. Okay, good job, table. Now on to <laughs> no, me. Wait, pole. Pole. Good job. So the pole, pole. finally, th- like a javelin, just... And um, we're going to say that that moves him five feet when he gets hit by that, because it's a big Does ass he thing. knock him over? Um, Yeah, he gets knocked to the ground. Huge. Yeah. And okay. away from his spear. Table. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Whoa, that was a weird thing you to look at. You already rolled for the table. Huh? No, you that was the pole. 15. What? Right? I, I watched her roll a 15 Oh, for the gotcha. Table. Oh. 15, 15 does not hit. Plus. Wait, I rolled 15, so yeah. 20. Oh, it's plus five. then it does hit. <laughs> okay, yay. 2d6 plus one. 11. 11 damage from the table. On, and yeah. um, high or low, the table in that third strike snaps in half. That's fair. Um, They have HP. Hmm? They have HP. How does that HP. work? They have 40 HP? Yeah, the table does. It has 40 HP, so I don't know. Oh, I wasn't work. keeping track of that. I was just kind of looking at like a durability thing because okay. it's a table. Gotcha. Mm-hmm. Okay, so then does it become two small pieces? I think you could still, yeah. Or I mean, would it would still be, be medium table? I'd uh, small, two yeah, small I'd tables. Yeah, I'd say two, yeah, two little okay. end tables. Two small t- <laughs> end All right, tables. So <laughs> you, you're writing down my damage, right? Yes. Okay, good. Okay, so table went. Now on to two small swords. <laughs> Okay, so 15 plus 6, 21. Okay, <laughs> Jesus <laughs> fuck. To hit, or that was the damage? 21. Oh, okay, okay. Never mind. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to flip it over. 20 damage, collectively. 20 damage? Mm hmm. Okay. And then on the two small spikes. Not 20. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Are you fucking serious? <laughs> <laughs> All gonna, this advantage, I'm gonna, I'm gonna man. get my headphone bag back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, roll on that forever. Let's all roll. On. <laughs> Let's pass it around now. So um, everybody gets a turn. So twenty, okay. right? Because they're each d10. No, it, this is this different. is d8, d8 plus two, so, so ten. ten. So, so 20. it is twenty. Yes. Yeah, I remember because you, you created them last time. Yeah. Oh right, yeah. Four and eight, eight. plus four, twelve. So 20 plus 12, so 32 damage. <laughs> Mother from of the God. From yeah. the tiniest little thing. So How do you get that many things? <laughs> there, yeah, you get 10 total, I think, right? And mm-hmm. each one is yeah. ins- like based on their size. God. Are they mm-hmm. stuck in him? What? Are she basi- him? or He basically pulled them out because they were stuck in him and launched them right back in. <laughs> so they're just... <laughs> I'd like to imagine I'd try to go for the same wounds if I can. Ouch. Ooh. Oh, Very nice. It's die. Owie. Jesus fuck. So with that, so you watch Pinwin, and then, boom, he gets hit, knocked back. He's prone, and then, <laughs> yeah, swords, <laughs> table, Brace and man. then, th- 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 right into him, like, oh! and uh, now he's looking pretty haggard. And Jesus, I'm doing I a little dance. So. <laughs> You're dancing. <laughs> yeah. Willem Pinwin is. Doing uh oh shit I forgot the what worm it's no <laughs> oh the yeah I don't what know what that's it? called what? the tea bagging oh oh tea bagging, oh, tea oh. bagging. gotcha ew I'm <laughs> do that, ew, that she says. Movement. he's just like tea bagging when you put somebody no I know what it is <laughs> no. I put, he was, I was doing like the but yeah. your pantomime of it is like no, no that's no. like the video game version of tea bagging you yeah. just stand over him and you crouch it up and down real fast <laughs> <laughs> that's what they always do in like Halo like mm-hmm. you just go. <laughs> it's, it's so disrespectful. I and it love pisses it. Pisses you off. Yeah. So yeah. many tea bags. You just motherfucker. <laughs> I'm targeting that guy. Next round. Even if it Enemy happens favorite. to me, I just laugh though because it just looks. So yeah, they're just. <laughs> I get so mad. Not laugh. <laughs> Speaking of which, uh, I'm going to cast hideous laughter. Okay. On. Uh, M. Bison here. <laughs> what's what's the save? <laughs> uh, it's a wisdom of 18. Knock him down while he's down. He saves. Oh. Just barely, though. Oh. That's cool. I'm sorry. No, and that would cancel the sorry. blind... Or the, yeah, the blindness. Yeah. Since oh, it's concentration, no. correct? Mm-hmm. Oh, fair. So now he's not blind anymore, oh, guys. 
but he's still but he's flanked prone. all over the place. <laughs> and prone. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I guess that's it. Uh, Herstag. Sorry, Willem. <laughs> Why are you sorry? Fucking go. I'm sorry, <laughs> Willem. Don't be sorry. I- Fucking go. Don't patronize him with your apologies. Yeah, sometimes you don't. Well, fucking... maybe maybe it does hit. Maybe, maybe it does hit. Fuck you. <laughs> you can't hit every time. If you do, it'd be fucking boring as shit. Do we need to roll for his whirlwind? Thirty-nine damage. No, to we're just gonna assume. Unless you yeah. just shine. Unless you decide to change you it up. You should just roll the save, and then if you fail the save, then they all die. <laughs> <laughs> but that's a, that's fair. I am waving my staff. Oh, so he's still gyrating. Oh, yep. I could watch you do that forever. <laughs> <laughs> Make a gif of it. So it's just on repeat. All right, Gorble, it's your turn. Okay. So the spikes are still in him. Yes. I'm casting heat metal. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Hell yes. yeah. Yeah. Woo. Internal burning. <laughs> Suck it, bitch. <laughs> okay. Who were you saying that to? <laughs> you looked at stuff. <laughs> you know who I was saying. You, know. you fucking saying it to the spikes. He knows. Okay. Huh. <laughs> huh. <laughs> a lot. Ah, oh, shit. It's a concentration one, so that would cancel out my... Okay, we still got some time here. My bestow curse, wouldn't it? Um. Well, yeah. would the curse go away? Yeah, I think so. Really? Because there are curses that last like 24 hours and stuff. Heat metal. Go ahead. So I'm casting heat metal at third level. Okay. Here I go. <laughs> here, here we go. What's the damage? <laughs> All right. 3 d <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> it was it wasn't a booger, it was like some weird lint thing. Um. <laughs> <laughs> there was no pen. <laughs> no, uh what was it? Sorry, I was focused on 14. 14. 14. 14. Okay. <laughs> so you just hear him go, you see like <laughs> like steam come out and you just hear <laughs> So now he has disadvantage on attack rolls because he can't take that off. <laughs> yeah, they're like in his back, the checks. back of his shoulder too. All right. And he's prone. Yeah, for a moment. Yeah. Um. All right. So and now Burnus is burning. <laughs> Burnus the burning. I'm burning. Burnus for you. He slowly pushes himself up and stands and looks at all of you now that he can see. And uh, he was surrounding him. Uh, Lewin, Tomar, and Gorbel. And he, he looks at you three. And uh, he's got smoke coming out of his back, and he he like looks up and down at himself, and he just says, "I yield." Whoa! No one's ever done this before. What would he say? <laughs> <laughs> uh, he he said he yields. What? Do we should if, we kill him? If I continue, you will kill me. Well, what the fuck are we supposed yeah, to do well, with well, you now? What will we do with him? Mm, you could let me go. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> For Leandria! <laughs> Are you gonna attack him? Yeah, I'm gonna attack. Okay, <laughs> you got the name right. Nice. <laughs> yeah, you you would probably even hear that herstag. For Leandria! Twenty nine. For Leandria! <laughs> Natural twenty. Oh shit. Uh, and twenty eight. Okay, so roll the damage for your first two. 14. Yeah. 14. Okay. And then 19 plus. Should we make him an ally or something? But can 22. we be trusted? Plus 22? 28 plus 22. Okay. Oh, fuck. Okay. Um, da, 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 da. I, I, I have it here. Oh, sweet. Mathed it. All right. Now, do the damage for your critical. I did. <laughs> and 2d4. So 50 plus 5 radiant damage. All right. And as a bonus action, I put my dick in his mouth. Wisdom <laughs> save. Wisdom save? Okay. 15. Does not save. He's blind again. <laughs> so you just, for Leothondria, you watch Tomar, and then he just all of a sudden his eyes, and he's blind again. And he, he sort of like, goes close to the ground and 
he kind of puts his hand up, like to shield himself. And he's going to put his fingertips into the dirt. And you see like this magical... He's burrowing! Energy kind of ripple out of his hand. Could he be an ally? No. No. Is this a reaction? (laughs) Okay. Oh, no. You, Gorbel, you, Tomar, and Lewin need to roll a dex save. Natural 20. I almost had one, but it flipped over to 14. Okay. 24. 24. You guys both roll to the side as the ground starts shaking. Lewin, however, isn't quick enough. And you guys watch as both Burnus and Lewin are, they're standing, or he's leaning into the ground, she's standing. You guys roll off to the side. That area of ground right here um, becomes disconnected and <laughs> flies up into the air. Super, super high. Hundreds of feet up. Lewin! Is she on it? Is She's it? on it, yes. They're both on it. Okay. And there's a big hole in the ground now as this section goes clear up into the sky. Like, about 150 feet. As far as you can reckon. And... That's all that happens for the moment. So is it just continuing to rise? Or? Yeah, it gets to about 150 feet and it stops. And you can hear like some ching, 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 ching up there as if some sort of combat is taking place. Whose turn is it? Well, yeah. it is now since... Um, he just went, right? It's going to be Pinwin's turn. Perfect. I'm going to no, shoot at him because I can. Oh, you, oh, I just went. Okay, yep, you're right. Sorry, Pinwin. I'm going to shoot at him because I can. It. You were... Like, it's, it's straight up, so it's going to be... Pretty much impossible for you to hit. But it's 600 feet. Yes, but you're looking up at a a point, so you'd have to shoot through rock. It, it's not like just him up there. I yeah. know. Can like, I try? I mean, you would. You there would be no way you could hit him unless you had some sort of magic arrow that can arc. But don't I have a magic arrow? I mean, no, I guess magic bow. You have. You do have some magic arrows. I do have magic arrows. So I mean, you could attempt something. Let me see. What do I have? I have all five still because I keep retrieving them, and I feel good about that. Um, because you have no line of sight whatsoever with this guy. Yeah. Hmm. If I froze him, would he fall down? Can't see him. I know. What are we listening to? <laughs> yeah, what is this? Um, what are you going to do, Penguin? Yeah, I'm going to try... Shooting with my oath bow, and I'll try to go ahead and use flame. A flame arrow? Flame arrow. Okay. Was that a bad shaking your head thing? It's not good. Billy? Well, Are you going to shoot it at the rock? I guess. Because you, can, you cannot feet, see him. 50 feet up. That's what I'm trying to like. Shooting at the rock. Imagine there's a floor <laughs> that shoots straight up. What's the range on Would the acid? animated objects? Can they float? They can't go that high. I'm just asking a question. Suck a dick. They can't go that high. I know. I was thinking about that too, but I don't think they can go that high. Okay. Um. So. Yeah. I guess instead of that, I'll try to do frost air on the rocks. Then it might be slippery, and they might fall off. Okay. Right? Aren't our allies up there? Yeah, my sister's up there. We can catch. What's Penguin gonna do? Pinwin. Unaided. <laughs> Pinwin is going to um, use his oath bow mm-hmm. to try to um, fire at him and I, use I a frost to, arrow, but I know it will probably hit the rock. I mean, it will hit the rock it because the you rock, cannot see, see him that's whatsoever. What you said. Yes. Okay. So don't roll. Uh, oh. Are you trying to make it frosty, the rock, on purpose? Yeah. Okay. Right? What's it? Be 22. Yeah. Does it hit rock? I mean, it hits the rock, yes. Do they slide off? Like old penguins? I mean, w- the effect of the ice arrow does what? I don't know. I haven't used it yet. This is the first time where it's hit. Really? Yep. Yeah. Oh. Didn't it land in a wall before? Yeah. Yep. And Did it make the wall icy? He didn't I mean, explain. 
it basically makes like a radius of whatever it touches. But I mean, if it's rock, you're just going to see like a like a radius of ice around the arrow itself, freezing a section, a small section of a very large piece of rock. So they won't slide off? No. <laughs> it's like a five foot what radius. What do we do then? And you wouldn't want Lumen to slide off anyway, because you might die. I mean, <laughs> we could have caught him. Willem, it's your turn. Unless you're doing something else. <sighs> Can't shoot him. He's like, what can anyone do? Just start having your objects fly up there. Oh, that's right. Yeah, my bonus action. My anime, or my objects, I'm going to have them move up 30 feet. Okay. So they're Because that's as far as they can go. So they're, so they're just 30 making feet their way. Now? Mm-hmm. Okay, gotcha. All right, Willem. I'm just looking around frantically at everyone, like, <laughs> somebody do something. I'm trying! How can we get up there? Can somebody get me up there? Um, I can polymorph you. Into? Choose. Maybe something flying? Giant eagle or something. What the fuck are you doing? Eagle! No matter get him. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> Suck my fucking dick, Elijah. <laughs> What do you want to do? Like, is an albatross too big? That's probably too big. That's like dragon size, right? Turning into a biggest <laughs> bird. Uh, flamingo. <laughs> <laughs> what do you turn him into? Big bird. <laughs> From Sesame Street? Biggest yeah, bird. One. I'm not very uh, wise to my bird types. So what, does, you, does, what would Gorbel wait, turn him wait, wait. into? All right, what do you do on Gorbel? I'm just going to turn him into a giant eagle or something. <laughs> okay. Powerful, fast, and large. Okay. <laughs> and I cast it on good. him. Okay. So <laughs> you become a giant eagle, Willem. Sick. Now what? You I'm going to fly enemy. the fuck up there. Okay. He has the intelligence of the giant eagle. Yeah. They're so pretty you, smart, I think. But you retain your personality. So. So I'm just really drunk. So did you guys <laughs> did you guys just switch turns essentially? I mean, I figure yeah, you guys are we we're kind of collaborating like yeah, what the really fuck? Cuz be... I mean, he yielded and then you were like I'm going to do this. And so it's kind of like a free for all at that point, isn't it? No, cuz he was next in line uh, to attack. But oh. After this, we'll go back to like normal initiative cuz Penguin just went. Um, you were next, so we're going to kind of combine those two turns and then now it's going to be her stag. Um, well, I assume I noticed the earth flow. Yeah, that's pretty hard to, hard to. So I'll leave my whirlwind there and, um, I will wild shape into a giant eagle. Okay. So (laughs) now her stag is a giant eagle with a beard and, uh, (laughs) Willem is a giant eagle and I will full start flying up there. All right. So you guys both start soaring up there. Tomar. Uh, I'm just going to wait for now. And I will actually dash, so that's... uh, They have 60-foot movement, Okay. so I've made it up 120 feet. Okay, so you're almost there. Are you also going to do the same thing? Like, go as fast as possible? Yeah, uh, their speed is 10 feet. They fly 80 feet. Oh, Oh. 80-foot movement. Oh, so... 160 feet. So, yeah, you guys are up. Like you guys dashed essentially, (laughs) and you guys crest up, and you can see that Lewin does his cunning action work while he's in that form because he could have bonus action. I think you retain the abilities of the thing you're turning, yeah, the giant eagle, so you wouldn't be able to like cast a spell or anything. Yeah, that's fine. So you guys crest up above this like floating rock essentially, and you can see that. Now Burnus is, he's got a sword out now, and him and Lewin are sword fighting at the top of this rock. And she's not doing the best, but, yes. So while he was up there, before I cast Polymorph, heat metal was still going on, and he was attacking. Yes. So he had disadvantage on all those, but also he was taking damage. still taking mm-hmm. damage. Yeah, so go ahead and roll the damage for heat metal. So he's, he's, that does kind of change the landscape. So they both, she's actually looks like she's getting the upper hand a little bit because he's going to be having disadvantage on his attacks. So, so that's what you guys kind of see as you crest that area. So go ahead and roll spikes. damage. Okay, so for that, how many, how much damage is it per I should say for his turn? You can only heat one object, I think. And it's the spikes. Yeah, the damage just goes up. So it's just on his attack rolls? 
that he takes on, or my turns, or... It would just be, yeah, like your turn. I think it's on his turn. Well, either way. Well, just, how many yeah. does he add? Well, one. Three. Three? Okay. So he, so you guys, as he crests above the rock face, you guys see him go... Ah! What and level did you cast heat metal at? Third. Because it should be multiple die. Yeah. Oh, I get the full damage again? Yeah. It's oh, a, damn! It's a but burning. it was only it was only before... You yeah. cast poly. So it's for that one round. Okay, so three plus eight. All right. So you guys crest the side, these two majestic giant eagles. And you guys see in the circle of raised earth floating 150, abo- 150 feet above the ground, they're just ching, 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 like shredding blows. And because of the disadvantage of his burns, um, he seems to be kind of at least equal, if not a little bit behind uh, what Lewin's doing, but she's still not familiar with combat. At least, seems like I'll, I'll rectify that. She seems like she's, you can tell, getting back into the swing of things. Um, and so yeah, you can see them trading blows and uh, parrying, and it it's a it's a pretty pretty decent fight that you're watching right now. Um, Pinwin. I can't do anything, right? Move your object. Oh, up. that's right. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that okay, man. A little bit. <laughs> but my impression of Seth. Yeah, it was pretty good. I will move. It's like Grover from Sesame Street. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty much how I do any man voice. Or Gonzo. <laughs> I like Gonzo. Oh, yeah. Um, I will move. Well, he's my... a Muppet. He is. I'm thinking a different thing. Muppets are life. It's always relevant. They're pretty much Sesame Street. I mean, Pretty sure Kermit was on Sesame Street. What are you They're doing? Fun. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to move all my objects up another 30 feet. So now there's 60 feet in the air. Oh, man. Moving on up. Willem, you're first to go here. Okay, so so I look at her stag, and I'm flapping in place <laughs> like a fucking giant feathered harrier jet. And I, I try and communicate to him in some way to try and distract. We still have thinkies, right? Going on? No. It no. lasts an hour. Um, yeah, this has been under an hour. Oh, oh sweet. Yeah, so Excellent. you guys can communicate. Awesome, even better. So, her stag. But your, yeah. your intelligence is a lot lower, so you might have to speak in more simple terms. Her stag. What's up? Fuck. Um. Bison. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. <laughs> um. Claw. Eyes. Uh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he just says claw eyes. Uh, give me an insight check. <laughs> I think he means claw eyes. Nine. Nine. It sounds like claw eyes to you. Okay. Um, and then I'm gonna swoop in mm-hmm. and try to grab onto Lewin's shoulders. Okay. All right. Give me. How do I, how am I gonna do this? Um, give me a dex. G- give me athletics. An ex- athletics roll to swoop in and grab something that's like in the middle of combat. Okay. They have a plus they three. Plus have three, yeah. I got athletics. It it's dex, I'm assuming. No, strength. Uh, that'd be strength. <clears throat> oh, well, fuck me. Still plus, three, plus three. And yeah. eat my dick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that's an eight. Okay. So your first, like, swoop in, you're, you're a little wide. It's hard to, I mean, this is your first time as sure. a bird, so <laughs> uh, you're going to get your bearings and kind of mm-hmm. swoop past. Okay. Her stag. I'm going to try to pick up Lewin. Okay. You're not pouring eyes? No. <laughs> You're just like, I'm not going to listen to the two intelligence <laughs> giant eagle. <laughs> um, Says the two intelligence giant eagle. <laughs> Fuck you. No, he, he doesn't have it because he's, that's a, he. I uh, keep my intelligence with his spell, with my wild Because he has wild shape. Oh, also fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 19 to grab her. Okay, so you see, you see Willem swoop and try to grab and go, is a bit off on his. Uh, trajectory. Oh, that's what he meant. Okay. <laughs> and so he like, <laughs> and then you go and you do grab. Now give me uh, strength. Okay. Ten. 
Ten. Ten. What's the giant eagle's carrying strength? Um, it's a large beast, so it would be okay. And a she, lot more than yeah. She doesn't medium. weigh much, so you you grab on the shoulders. Pretty good, nice, sizable thing. And just as Burnus is swinging, <laughs> swing off with swing, <laughs> swinging off. <laughs> And uh, at full volume, yeah. swinging off, <laughs> so, swinging off this. So way. then Lewin just like she like looks up at you, her stag. This beard's like hanging down, and she sees <laughs> the, the other giant eagle, and she's just like, ah! <laughs> she's like, oh fuck! I wink at her. <laughs> yeah. It's okay, Lewin. All right. Um, In my head, Gorbel. Oh yeah, part she's of connected. The... Yeah. Oh nice. Ooh. It's me, her stag. Just here saving you. <laughs> oh okay. <laughs> so not much is going on yeah, down you just on see, ground you just, level. Yeah. I want to keep concentrating on that for Willem's sake. Um, there's like nothing I can really do. Okay. It's hard. It's so you hard. You could, I don't know, take the ready action. <laughs> is, I guess I'm just you like. You have to ready something. Are you, you still can, a heat metal? No. no. Oh. Now I'm polymorphing. Oh, that's right. Um, you could try to disintegrate the ground. Meta gaming. Sorry. No, because then I don't. I don't know if. You yeah, guys you are all from safe. what? You, yeah. So oh, do yeah, what you're gonna do. Cone of fucking Sorry. silence. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think I'm just going to. I'm going to do a look around. Okay, give me a perception check. Seven. Seven. You, it's really confusing. There's a lot going on. That You can see that there's the battle raging. You can see that this is up, and you can see the eagles dive bombing. But okay. other than that, just it's a pretty it's pretty chaotic and confusing. Can you explain the battle at all? Yeah, sure. So I what just, you can I see from the battle, you can see that Smoozog, the uncaged wolf, has been like clawing through people with his axe. He's just chopping over and over. Um, it seems like he just like one hitter quitters a lot of them and then moves on to the next one. He's just like a, an assembly line of murder. I know and how he's that just, feels. <laughs> <laughs> and you can see uh, Maury Mudfury is hurling her like explosive things into these crowds of soldiers and they're <laughs> um, awesome. Lance has his hand out and a, and a book in his other hand. And you can see that there's this weird mist creeping through the ranks, and anybody that it touches is immediately dissolving. They're you can see like they're they just like drop out of view, but like their skin kind of just falls off, and you can see their skeleton just crumple. Oh, Nerdy that's but metal. badass. <laughs> yeah, uh, Vo- Fuck, that's metal. Vocha is like kiting around the outside where he's just with his two crossbows. He's and he's just yeah firing firing in there. And um, you do notice that behind you guys, Herc hasn't done anything. He seems to have been pilf- like not pilfering, but like kind of perusing through Filching. some items in his satchel, and he's been very busy with that um, for some purpose or another. Did you say what Smoochie and Zygo were doing? Yeah. Oh, forgot about Zyko. Smoochie so Smoochie's just like clawing through people. Right next to Smoochie is Zyko with his halberd and he's laying waste and he seems to be occasionally casting something with his hand, some bright spell that will target a group of soldiers and then they get like blasted away. Like, Can we say that they're fight? the two are fighting back to back and like moving? Yeah, they're very, yeah, they're very in cohesion. Like the, much like how you and Tomar were in the battle, Zyko and Smoochie are like that too. It's the, the master and his pupil uh, fighting together, and uh, yeah, they're they're making they're laying waste to a cer- a specific section while the others are focusing on kind of outliers. But yeah, there's a lot of chaos. The chaos company definitely lives up to their name because they are making it impossible for these soldiers to do anything but die. And so, yes, yeah, so that's what you see through the fog of war, even <laughs> um, and the confusion. Um, I'll do you, Tomar. <laughs> Take me out first. <laughs> um, you go first, and then uh, then we'll continue. So I'm gonna put the sword into the ground while I do this, but then uh, I'm gonna reach for my horn at my side, and my mm-hmm. eyes are gonna glow white. Okay. I'm gonna 
Uh, and then I'm going to summon Bill the Goat. Okay. I always picture it like Power Rangers, like the it shows the, <laughs> the Zord running from a distance. <laughs> yeah, so in the ethereal Coming plane, in. he's like eating cud, and then you just... And he looks up, and then right into like a portal, basically just... And then you can hear his his like clomping before he actually shows up and then and he's there I'm gonna bend down towards him put my hand on his the side of his head and I'm gonna be like go to Moonreach scout bring me news of what you find <laughs> and then off Bill and then <laughs> and he disappears like into another little portal thing and then I'm gonna look up to see what's going on okay so, um, Herstag, you're, what are you, you, what are you two doing right at this moment? Not actions, but what has just happened? Are you, what's your next plan of attack? So I grabbed Lewin uh-huh. and I'm flying back to the ground. Okay. I'm Drop circling her. back, uh, from my failed attempt to grab my sister. Okay. And, uh, gonna try and fuck with, um, what's his face? Burnus. Burnus. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I keep wanting to call him Bison. Burnus, <laughs> uh, and try and knock him off. So you're going to get prepared to do that? Yeah. Okay, so you two can see... You drop down. So, Willem, you're really the only person that sees this. You... Burnus looks up at you, and he just has, like, this really serious expression, and he's, like, holding him his side and stuff like that. He looks, like, really worse for wear. And he just holds his hand up, and then all of a sudden the rock starts shaking again, and then the massive rock starts on fire. Just massive columns of flames are coming off of it. And then he, his hands up and then he drops it down like that at the wrist. And the entire platform plunges down with him. Oh shit. Him on it. You guys can now see this. So it kind of drops like you, you're here, he's here. And then, so you're just kind of getting ready and then you see it drop. You guys see the rock above you full of flames and start speeding at you more than a normal drop would do, almost as if it's being propulsed by something. Holy shit. Mm. I think to the group, guys, look out. He's coming in hot. It's I think I see it. I think I see it. <laughs> stupider, stupider, Willem. You got to be stupider than that. <laughs> guys. Was that my flame arrow? Ha- <laughs> hamburger time? <laughs> That's stupid. Perfect. <laughs> um, and so, yeah, it's it's now racing at you guys. What do you want to do? You have a second or two. Well, it's, it's coming falling, fast. and then I'm trying to hit it with my pole. It's huge. It's the yeah. whole rock thing. Yeah, it's like tw- like 30 feet by 30 feet. Can I see him on it while he's falling? No. Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> I'm not sure you understand what this looks like. He's up here, and a big rock, like basically think of a meteor. Yeah. Is and now, not in the area, though, or it would fall. Yeah, but he's, all he can see is the bottom of the rock. I'm yeah. just saying, <laughs> like, you don't really need to do anything in defense of what's happening. Well, yeah. I mean, if the radius is huge. I'm just trying to see if I can. You guys can all see this speeding him. at you now. This is a massive piece of earth. I'm going to get the fuck earth. out of the way. You're gonna, okay, so you're going to race out of the way? Yes. Okay. Um, give me an athletics. Say. Uh, no, just give me athletics. That's like. Oh, a natural 20. <laughs> so, um, you, Gorbel, you look up and then you're just like, <laughs> you're gone. I shall also do an athletics. 29. 29. Okay, so you like <laughs> you start heading off. Uh, Penwin, what are you going to do? I'll try to move back if I need to. Just a little bit in case there is some damage that happens. Okay, go ahead. You're going to move back a little bit? I mean, I think can wherever Penwin, they're going... Can Penwin tell if it's going to hit him if he doesn't... You win. might want to move back more than a little bit, Penwin. Oh. You can tell that this thing is coming in hot and it's huge. Okay, then sure. I'll hop on Shadow and try to run. You hop on Shadow, try mm-hmm. to run? Okay, so you hop on. Give me athletics for, I guess, Shadow. 
Okay, 13? No, athletics, yeah, so 13. Okay, so you're, like, going along, so you're at your normal You're at your normal speed plus the 10, 15? What? What's oh, from oh, 15? Yeah, 15. so what's your speed with shadow plus 15? Speed is 40 feet. Oh, okay, gotcha. So, yeah, so 55, 55. feet. So, and then plus if he's racing along, so it'd be 110 feet. So, yeah, he just <laughs> moves out of the way. And, um... I guess her stag. Willem's right here. Oh yeah, no, no Willem's, Willem's in, in the, the air. Sky. <clears throat> All right. Um, Willem and her stag give me perception. Or I guess, uh, oh yeah, you, you're an eagle, so yeah, you have eagle eyes. Fuck. Nine. Nine. Oh, I get my <clears throat> regular perception bonus. Um, fifteen. Okay. So Willem, you just see a flaming rock flying down towards there. Her stag, you see, um, Herc. Snake Punch, very calmly, takes something out of his um, pouch, and it looks like a little vial, and he just smashes it on himself, and you see, like, you see, like, this weird kind of, like, growth grow all over his body, and he just looks up, and then the fucking meteor bomb just slams into the ground and a ton of rock and debris come flying up into the air and it's still on fire and you can see that Burnus is holding with his fingers into the into the uh, into the rock itself and you guys are all kind of like at a distance and the the, the smoldering rock is still like just it's going hot and the smoke is coming up and you can see Herc walk up and onto the platform where where uh, Burnus is and he just walks up to Burnus and he grabs him around the neck and he just squeezes. And you see this big muscular alchemist just squeeze his neck and he... And then nice. he just goes limp. Yeah! yeah. And then he slowly steps off of the, the rock. What the fuck? And that's where we're going to end for the night. Shit. So an NPC kills our enemy. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah. Yeah, fun. Fucking red. I hope he's. Well, yeah, no, that's good, right? Why not? I mean, we were trying to kill him the whole right. time. Yeah, yeah. 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 So like, yeah. Lindsay, yeah. just come in. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> Stop questioning everything. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so wow. So that was an wow. entire uh, uh, session full of or episode full of uh, combat. Um, you guys are each going to take some experience now. No so, way. <clears throat> everyone for that fight will take 6,000 experience points. Whoa. Woo. Hi, boy. <laughs> <laughs> and what else do you need to experience for? Because that was like the majority of the... Oh, thank you. Bonus XP for metagaming. <laughs> 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 You um, go down to level 14. <laughs> um, I think you misunderstand the meaning of bonus. <laughs> All the crits everyone did. Yeah, yeah we had some crits. Yeah, that yeah. was like, I feel Just like that's take, the most I've ever critted ever. I think it's the most any of you guys have critted together in a session. So yeah. everybody, regardless of whether or not you critted, uh, go ahead and take an additional 150 experience points. Wee. Counterspelling. Yeah. You can have 50 for each one, so two times. Um, that's 100. Giving everybody <laughs> boosted speed. You can have 50 for that. You can also have 50 for doing the portal jump and slashing him. Mm. I think uh, Pinwin should get some more for handling the killer debris. Yes. <laughs> the killer yeah, 50 exp- floating. You know what? So 100 damage. experience points for that because it was so effective. He did insane more, damage. More so than any of us thought. <laughs> and yeah. really hard to manage. How about um But I did it. Yeah. Oh, Herstag, you can have you can have 50 experience points for doing c- crowd control and uh making sure that even though it wasn't the um, the guy immediately there, making sure that those soldiers were not going to become an issue. Cool. Um I think her Herstag should get some more for saving Lewin. Oh yeah. You can have 100 for that as well. Um, oh, and for polymorphing, you can have 50. Mm-hmm. Thinking to send Bill ahead to scout. You can have 70 for that. Um, for Smoochie for fighting like a badass with Zyko. He can, yeah, he can have 50, you know, make sure that Zyko gets 50. 
<laughs> using some flourish. Oh yeah. yeah you can take thirty experience for using flourish. That's more than I would have given myself. <laughs> <laughs> um all right, that's it. I'm going to have to start another session retrieving my arrow <laughs> if I can. Good luck finding it. <laughs> yeah. I know. <laughs> yeah, that's the one section that didn't burn. <laughs> it's just ice. <laughs> um, so, yeah, you guys, uh, that was a, the very, uh, very combat heavy. Let's do our MVPC. So, think in your minds or wherever you think from um, who Big you want to vote for. Butt. Yeah, think from your butt. <laughs> think with your butt. Um, one is Tomar, two is her Steg, three is Pinwin, four is Gorbel, five is Willem, and uh, think about who you want to vote for, and then I'm going to count to three. Everybody got it? Uh-huh. One, two, three, vote. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. So we've got four votes for Pinwin and one vote for Gorbel. <laughs> Tomar, why'd you vote for Pinwin? It's a crazy amount of damage. Yeah. Multiple crits. Fucking flying debris, like, it was like at least a third of his HP was taken out just by Pinwin. More than that. So. (laughs) Much more than that. Yeah, he was doing way more damage than Doing the wicked damage. (laughs) Yeah, I think all our reasoning is the same. Yeah, I was going to say, he's going to be having additional reasoning. Yeah, no, essentially, yeah, just. And then it is a walking death machine. (laughs) Which is funny because he's so little. The creativity of the animate objects. Mm Mm-hmm. Yep. And it's like Especially when we finally got it under like <laughs> the umbrella of what it actually does. Adorable the there are little spikes at the end. <laughs> <laughs> also for not understanding that he could not possibly hit uh what's the top of that. <laughs> still <rock>. wanting <laughs> yeah. still, still wanting like, to fire. Like, can I just I'm gonna hit? shoot through the rock. Like, <laughs> um It's like the guy in Venture Brothers that throws his gun. Yeah, <laughs> 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 you gotta you gotta quit doing that. Pinwin, why'd you vote for Gorble? I voted for Gorbel because she was super awesome, and um, her <laughs> heat metal with the spikes. Was oh yeah, like take cool. A, like take uh, yeah. Yeah. take another thirty for the heat metal. Teamwork. No, I think we did the heat metal, didn't yeah. we? Yeah, very we? very close second mm-hmm. for me to vote Which for I Gorbel because that was fucking rad. Mm-hmm. All right, very cool. So that means Pinwin is tonight's MVPC. <laughs> Yay! Take Ow! you five hundred experience points or whatever. Okay. Or whatever. I'm thinking <laughs> I, so I get to choose. So 500 million? Got it. There Done. <laughs> well, Wait. unless there's any more uh, things on the agenda, I think I'll do these closing credits here, folks. Uh, did you level up? I did. And nice. I'm just going to say Woo. real quick because I didn't really get anything. My mm-hmm. proficiency went up and that's it. Tight. I might have gotten more uses of something, but it's not No important. spells? No nothing? I'm not a mage. Oh, yeah. I'm any kind. Dummy bitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for listening, folks. We've got Adrian Von Ziegler with the background music, Chad Piper rocking the intro song. Thanks to all of you listeners. We love you. Please check out all of our social media, our Patreon, become a patron, find out what tier best suits you. And you know what? Have a good week until we see you next time. Uh, but that's it for us. We are the D20 Syndicate podcast where we go on adventures so you don't have to. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Peace. (laughs) Gangster. (laughs) Gangster. Dag. Butter (laughs) stag. Butter makes a butter stag better. Does anybody need to do anything before no. we start? I don't know. Oh, I need to pop my elbow. Away. Shit, hang on. I got to do my taxes. <laughs> oh, it, shit, Billy. I should keep paying for those. You're kind of late on that. <laughs> yeah, I had to do an amendment. Oh. That penalty. Ooh. Is that a thing? Mm-hmm. Billy slinging that knowledge Show that no off. one cares about. Yep. <laughs> I hate taxes. I mean, I care. So much. Especially the people that call me to talk about it. They, for some reason, super don't care. (laughs) Which is probably why they're talking. Even though they're specifically calling me to talk about it. Fuck (laughs) you. Help me, you dick. I I picture him not doing taxes because, like, he keeps all of his paychecks and cash in a cigar box or something. It's like a rat king, but paychecks. (laughs)
And then he... You literally did that. <laughs> I, yeah, I did. That was a joke. <laughs> I did that. When That's I, uh... your life. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I do my hair. Mama, Sony that, dice song, bag. that song made me want to have my nails pretty. Okay, let's get I started. I never do my nails. <clears throat> you ready to do the recap? I well. suppose. <clears throat> do you get your nails done often? No, I never have them done because I hate it. Let's do I the recap. Do. I like doing Let's do own. the recap. I can't think Let's of the worst thing you guys could be talking about. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just was thinking about it. I really don't take care of them. But recap. Anyway, I can yeah. think of something worse. <laughs> Let's talk about Tomas. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about the recap. <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> My nails are perfect all the time. <laughs> cool. All right. See? Go. <laughs> See? <laughs> go ahead. Uh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, because next session where he's gonna be like, so actually, <laughs> when you we casted did that, <laughs> wrong guy. It's like instead of Adam ruins everything, <laughs> Elijah, Elijah ruins D and D. Do you need you to want drink some water? something? Yeah. I did. I don't drink know. more. I'm good. Are you sure? You want some booze? No. No. <clears throat> you want a cigarette? No. <laughs> Definitely. <not. laughs> Two cigarettes. <laughs> okay. Three cigarettes, final offer. And a lollipop. <laughs> <laughs> to wash it all down with. <laughs> oh, nice. Shove it down your throat. Oh, I don't know if I told these guys about projectile vomiting at you. What? Did I? Next break. Oh, my God. <laughs> Save it. It's good. Um, okay, so you guys. We you, don't want it on the podcast? No, we can record it. I just mean because oh, okay. we're in the middle of something. No, it's private. <laughs> <laughs> it's not for their ears. Private projectile puking. Nice. Triple P. One experience. (laughs) Um.